Hi kids. Good morning. I wish you a blessed and happy new year. Welcome back to this art class. Hope you are all doing good. Children, I am delighted to meet you all through this online class. As Vasily Kandinsky said, there is no must in art because art is free. Take a minute and have a look at this art children. And now these are grids which is made up of horizontal and vertical lines. So this type of art is called grid art. Grid art, okay? Okay. Take a paper, pencil and a ruler to draw this grid art. If you have art note, you can take it. Shall we start our class, children? Okay, first draw some vertical lines like this. And then draw some horizontal lines like this. On the grid, you can draw any picture. Here I have drawn tree. The main thing that enhances this grid art is coloring. Yes, so Take your colors children, it's time to color your grid art. Always keep it in mind that you should use contrast colors and on the grid art. Initially, leave the boxes in which you have drawn a tree and color the remaining boxes, okay? First, I have taken a red color and choose the boxes randomly and colored. Then, I have used yellow color and filled some of the boxes. I used orange color thirdly to fill out boxes. Now color the gray on which you have drawn a tree. First by using a brown color Fill out some of the boxes in the trunk of the tree. Use different shades of the same color which will make this picture looks nice. So, next I have taken a chocolate brown color. And fill the left out boxes in the trunk region. Lastly, by using a light and dark shades of 
green i have colored the grid on which the leaf of the tree lies well done children you did a great job shall we try one more thing yes as i said earlier draw some horizontal and vertical lines to form a grid then draw hello kitty face outline on the grid leave the grid on which you have drawn a hello kitty face and proceed your coloring here i have used different shades of blue to color the grid first take a sky blue and fill some boxes randomly then i have chosen platypus blue to color some of the boxes lastly use much darker blue than the previous one to color the left out boxes Now it's time to color the remaining grid on which we had drawn a hello kitty face use different shades of pink to color the hello kitty face and for the bow use different shades of yellow color after coloring the whole gray draw two eyes and mouth on the face with the help of black sketch or marker like this do it in a correct place okay awesome children you got it okay bye bye thank you meet you in the next class with some new art lesson Okay bye bye Hi friends hope you had enjoyed the grid art Now I'll tell you some features about grid art A grid will help you to draw faster and more accurately Here I have some grid art pictures to show you you can use this idea to draw your own picture but you still have to come up with creative subject i believe that it will turn out to be great okay bye bye friends always remember Enjoy what what do